A Palm Beach County family believes more needs to be done on a certain roadway in order to protect not only them, but other drivers. On New Year's, this driver went right through their backyard and into the swimming pool. Frustrated over no response from the county, the family called News Channel 5. Our Andrew Lawholm got answers for that family after talking to that commissioner in their district. Andrew? All right, Kelly, so here's the problem right here. This is their home right here. Their backyard runs uh, parallel to Hagen Ranch Road and perpendicular to Maltrier Drive. So here's what's believed to be happened. A uh, driver blew through a stop sign right here and actually went right into their pool. And now the family is worried that this could happen again. The Bushmans rang in the new year with this splash landing. Came through these trees, our yard hit our concrete here on the patio. No one was home and the driver survived, but what's to stop it from happening again when someone is in the backyard? I have a four year old and a six year old and I, and they want to come out and play on the patio. They want to go in the pool. They want to come out here and play on their slide and they want to throw the ball. And my wife's telling them they can't. The Bushmans want protection. Any kind of barrier between a vehicle and this yard is going to help anything to deter people from just blasting down that road. But they say their calls to the county didn't yield any results. And I don't know who to go to for help. So they called us and we called County Commissioner David Kerner, who represents District 3, where the Bushmans live. It has to be a, a very unnerving and scary experience to go through. Kerner said a guardrail wouldn't have stopped a head-on driver, but he's willing to work with the Bushmans on just about any other solution, including installing a roundabout, rumble strips, more lighting, and signage. Certainly, I'm willing to look at speed bumps. I'm willing to work with the HOA and, and the property owners there to see if a wall could be installed. Uh, but we want to provide a very good sense of security to that constituent and we'll find a resolution for them. The first thing I said to the to the cops when they were here is that I'll never win an argument with my wife again because she says this is going to happen and I say no it isn't and it can happen again. And Kerner told me that he has asked the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office to increase patrols around the Bushman's neighborhood. Now, as for that crash, they have not ruled out drunk driving as a possible cause. They're still waiting for the blood test results of the driver. We're live in the newsroom, Andrew Lawfoam, WP.